That'll be the key later on. They're gone. Richardson knocks him over. Shadab's gone. Richardson continues to get wickets. That's his fifth for the tournament. And that's a big breakthrough. Yeah, really well set up from Richardson. Pace off in the first two deliveries. And, and we saw in game one how good his Yorker was. And that's a searing Yorker that gets under the bat of, of Shadab Khan. And um, so often as it does, the power surge, we look for boundaries and, and big scores. But two big wickets for the Scorchers have been thought about just by you know, the fielders coming up and then going potentially a little bit harder. Hurricanes, four for 120. We're in the 13th. As you get into your innings a bit more. Oh. 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 He's taking the pace off there. Oh, umpire thought about it. He thought about it, and I reckon the Perth Scorchers are going to think about it as well. If that's hit him on the full, that is absolutely plumb. <laughs> Gee, he's wanted... Original decision was not out. Pitching in line, impact in line, and wickets are hitting. Greg, I'll get you to change your original decision to out. I'll let you know when you're on the screen. You're on screen signal now. Davo says you're gone now. Jimmy Neeson's been deceived by a Jai Richardson beauty. That's a huge wicket for the Perth Scorchers. A lot of the momentum that the Hobart Hurricanes had built through that middle part of the innings is almost gone now, and, and they'll have to be in a stage where they try and rebuild and launch an assault at the back end of the innings. Yes! Yes! Oh, does he take it? Ashton Agar says, not a problem, like shelling peas. So Richardson gets another. Yeah, terrific, terrific change of pace. We've seen the Yorker. We know he can go into the pitch. 103 kilometers per hour is terrific. Climbing down from the previous ball, which was 142. And that was just the throw his shot too early. Outstanding bowling. He's always been one step ahead of the batsman tonight, particularly outside that power play when Matty Wade got a hold of him a little bit. It seems as though when he's at the top of his game, he's confident in the ball that he's going to bowl, but he's also one step ahead, almost one ball ahead. And, and you, if you get ahead of a batsman, it must be a great feeling as a bowler because I know the flip side, when you get ahead of a bowler, it's great. Yeah, Hurricanes are 8 for 136, 15.2 overs.